Hello everyone, welcome back to Aphrodite Men and Neil Tarot. I'm going to be doing a quick overall for 2022 for Gemini. Alright, Gemini. Let's see what's in store for you. Right, Gemini. The bottom of the deck we have the the Nine of Pentacles, Gemini. So something is very slow coming in for you. Okay, but we'll have a look. January. In January, you are dealing either with somebody in your workplace. Um, this is somebody who runs their own business. Um, this is also an Aries, uh, a fire sign. Uh, somebody who's a little bit controlling it doesn't necessarily have to be that sign but somebody who's a little bit controlling and wants to rule the nest and just you know determined to get what they want but uh, overall this is a, a father a leader a businessman some or a fire energy that has control okay that's in January in February somebody is trying to get away with something Okay, either there, there's sneaky behavior going on or somebody is leaving a situation and sneaking off, um, not wanting to talk about it, just packing up their things and going, okay? Um, but this is also the card of sneaky behavior, so somebody trying to get away with something, okay? In March, you have a reason to celebrate, okay? Um, if you don't have a reason to celebrate, this is a third-party energy uh, somebody interfering in your relationship, somebody that's, um, um, you know, got a third person involved in your relationship, but uh, this is an interference of somebody. Otherwise, you do have something to celebrate in March. Okay, in April. In April, I feel you have a little, a, f a bit of confusion going on, okay? Now, the confusion may not be a bad confusion. It may be that, you know, you have a variety of choices here and you just don't know which one to choose, okay? Um, but you're looking at your options here of what, what you need to do and um, making the right choices. Um, so making the right choices could be also confusing for you, but nevertheless, you have, you have options to consider in the month of... Um, in April okay okay whatever choice you made in um, in May you're gonna have a victory okay you're gonna be recognized for something that you did a job well done whatever um, it is that you've done there is a victory uh, about it okay now in June you are looking at your finances okay looking at um, well, this could be about how much effort you've put into something, whether there's any more growth in it, how to increase your finances, um, but trying to come up with a solution of making this money tree grow, okay? Now, if that's not the case, then be careful of your expenditure in the month of June, okay? In the month of July, you're feeling that there's secrets, okay? somebody is holding a secret there might be a betrayal there might be lies going around or you just can't see things very clearly but um in time the sun will reveal itself the moon will shift the sun will reveal itself and there is a possibility of happiness once all this is is taken care of okay all right in july you are looking at your stability your home your finances your grounding um you know looking looking after your kingdom okay so um you might be feeling a little bit lonely here in july but um 
there is a possibility of you being able to um, you know finally choose the right person for you to to share this home with or um, it's something to do with your home whether you're renovating whether you're looking after it whether you're thinking of moving staying staying where you are whatever it's all about the home okay in July okay in August I feel that you know you are carrying a heavy burden um, everything's being placed upon your shoulders um, you need to start releasing that um, I don't know what this heavy burden is um, to be honest because it's directly under the um, the three of cups the interference in the relationship that might be the heavy burden but um, you will deal with it you will deal with you'll you'll bring it all into one one package and just deal with it okay okay in October you're coming in as the wounded warrior um, this is somebody who's been through a lot of battles but is still willing to hold the door open just for one more try um, you know you do see this possibility of growth in that situation so um, this is like a wall that you place um, you know around you for protection but um, you still have hope that maybe things can be worked out okay um, in November I see you returning from somebody from your past or somebody from your past is returning to you okay this is also a love offer somebody who wants to try again somebody who wants to um, have a reunion um, but whatever it is it's issues from the past people from the past and there is there is love there there is a lot of love there okay so the possibility of reuniting with somebody from your past all right in December I feel that you have to make choices okay either you're gonna make a choice between two people two jobs um, or trying to balance out your money um, but Whatever it is, you have a choice of two, okay? So choose wisely because what goes around will come around. So make sure your decision is, you know, is is a good one. So, you know, you'll be making choices in December. All right. So I feel that all this is going to be very slow coming in for you. Um, there will be equal give and take. There is a possibility of moving forward to calmer waters. You are going to find your strength, okay? You are thinking of traveling leaving home um, you know maybe moving to a new state or moving somewhere where you can begin a new journey at the moment you're at a crossroad unable to make a decision but you have a brand new beginning you will put an end to this situation and you will transform um, this is rebirthing this is starting again starting new starting fresh so you know that's really good you have somebody around you who does keep secrets from you this could be a fire sign, but the universe is on your side, okay? So uh, whatever is going on, um, you will be protected by this and you will come through. But overall, you have a, a good reading, but just some things that you have to sort out in the new year. There's a possibility that you should have sorted this out this year, um, but because you didn't, um, you know it's it's going into the new year so sort it out in the new year so things can start fresh because you have a, a brand new beginning i wish you all the best gemini and good luck for with everything bye for now